Four men are vying for the Republican nomination to challenge Democratic U.S. Senator John Tester, and one of them is a surgeon, State Senator Al Oshesky of Kalispell. He says health care is the main reason he got into the race a year ago. Olszewski wants to ditch the Affordable Care Act, Obamacare, which he says has accelerated mass consolidation within the health care industry. It's destroyed your small business physician and provider, so they are no longer uh, in practice where you are their boss. Now your doctor um, and soon your dentist and your optometrist are going to be employed by hospitals. And guess what? They no longer work for you. They work for the hospital. Olszewski wants to peel back burdensome regulations on health care providers, stop drug companies from overcharging, and move toward more of a free market system where the customer has more power. Former State District Judge Russ Fagg of Billings also says Obamacare needs to go because it's too costly and that we need more consumer choice and competition. Yet Fagg says some sort of basic health care should be available to everyone. Everybody deserves a little bit of health care, some basic maintenance type of a health care system. But the path that we are on with the Affordable Care Act is just simply unsustainable. Matt Rosendale, as state insurance commissioner, says he's been working directly to create lower cost health insurance options and examine drug costs. Options in the works include businesses banding together to form insurance pools, and short-term health plans that don't have to meet Obamacare mandates. We're going to see many more products and services that will be available in 19 that were available in 18 and, and continue to help offer options that allow people to accommodate their health care needs. Big Sky businessman Troy Downing says he wants to focus on the cost of the system and then talk about coverage. He says drug companies should not be allowed to charge Americans many times more than they charge citizens in other countries and that more light should be shed on hospital charges. What business do you go to where you don't have some expectation of what it's going to what it's going to cost to get something done? I think that we need to have transparency there and I think we need to insist upon it. Republican voters will choose one of these candidates in the June 5th primary. Tomorrow, how is health care defining another primary contest? The five Democrats who want to challenge Republican Congressman Greg Gianforte. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News.